Good morning, everyone. Um, today's the day. Um, you can tell it's serious because I am wearing my serious glasses. And here's the news. I'd like to thank everybody who followed me on my social experiment. I plan on having another one soon. This is just the first step in my process of becoming a video producer. Having and starting my own video production company as an entrepreneur. For those of you who follow me, see the, 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 the thing that's messed up about Facebook and other social media is yeah, you do you do form a type of a friendship, but not the, the, the close tight bonds that come with pressing the flesh. Nothing beats tactile, physical, sensation, endorphin, pumping. You know what I mean. Anyway, here's the news. I'm at the place. This is the place that I showed you on the video that was entitled The Grand Tour. And I put my glasses back on, I can't see. This is the building that was on the Grand Tour. I've already called the landlord. I've got my first month's rent. I have to run down to um, the Jacksonville Electric Authority so that I can get the um, lights and the water transferred from out of his name because he did so much work, you know, it's still on. But transferred out of his name into mine. I um I've <laughs> paid my car insurance. I gotta like I said go do the light thing and pay him and um I'm trying to see. you know when you're up and you you're doing stuff and you you know more or less what you're doing but you feel like something's left out. Anyway. I just, I'm making this video to tell you, um, my friends, that um, I appreciate your friendship and that we're going to have some real adventures now. My, um, oh, one, other, one update. My breakout channel got starting to rain again. My breakout channel was um, taken over by Facebook. Because some whatever, whatever, um, told Facebook that I wasn't the person who I was saying that I was. But Facebook is so quick to do a knee-jerk reaction. They don't investigate. They tell you to send in a picture of your ID. Well, I did that three days ago. I haven't heard anything back from them. Not that we're going to give you your channel back. Or anything. But see, if you've been doing this like I have, and you've stepped on several toes like I have, and you have, <laughs> you freaking trolls, I almost cussed, you have trolls, haters, and stalkers. <laughs> I got a stalker. Yeah. And, and I'm the crazy one. But it's, um, you ever been in a relationship and the person you with just talks to you and treats you like shit, tells you you're nothing, you'll never be anything, you, you're stupid, you're dumb, I don't know why I fucked with you in the first place, um, you know, just some real negative fucked up shit. And this is the person that you was once having sex with. You know, you've seen each other, you've seen each other naked, <laughs> but now you're trash to them. They don't like anything about you and they don't want to be with you anymore. So you break up and you try to get over them. You know, the longer that you can stay apart and have no communication one way or the other, Time, they always saying time heals all wounds. Yeah, because the, the the longer I'm away from you, the more I get over you. 
But um, this particular <laughs> okay, you're my friends, right? I got you here in my car. You can't go nowhere. Look, this woman. God, I want to, I can't tell you what I want to tell you. I could, but it's too much for Facebook. But I will say this. I was involved in a relationship that became abusive. Not physically. There's more to abuse than physical contact. But um, she said I was nothing. I'll never be anything. Um, I'm dumb. I'm, I'm, I'm ugly. And, and I'm getting these fixed. This, this right here, if you guys were following me earlier, you'd have seen my trip to the dentist when I had these bad boys pulled out. Yeah. So thank God for the Affordable Health Care Act. But uh, they don't want you and they don't want nobody else to be with you. The thing is, when they break up with you, they, they want to see you just shrivel up and fucking die. They want you to just go off into the nanoverse and just become a fucking molecule and just disappear from the existence of the face of this fucking planet. And they don't want to be with you no more. They tell you that... I'm beginning to rant. They tell you that they don't want to be with you anymore. And then it turns out they don't want to see you happy. A.K.A. They don't want to see you with nobody else either. Even if they're in a relationship. So obviously you did some things that were right. That they still love about you. But they don't want nobody else to have. That's dangerous. If 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 I can't have you, nobody can. Or if you got somebody that's 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 emotionally and verbally abusing you all the time and talking all that <laughs> talking all that stuff and then have the audacity to stalk you on the internet. Look, and I'm gonna be respectful. Because I, I know it's a lot of you ladies out there watching. And I love every, every one of you girls. I love you all. But when you, if you are done with somebody, be done with them. Let them go on with their life. And stop being a fucking stalker. It pays to have a backdoor account. It pays to have several backdoor accounts. Anyway, um, <laughs> I got all off topic. Look, I'm finishing this transaction today to get this apartment. You've seen my living conditions. You've seen everything I've been through. And for people who who follow me and like my pictures and stuff, I wish you could convert that into money so I can get a decent laptop and a couple of GoPro cameras so I can go out in the street and do my thing. 